the Mahaveli being built today for tomorrow. The North Central Province Canal Project or NCPCP is the largest irrigation project in the Mahaveli Master Plan approved by the Government of Sri Lanka in 1968. The commencement of the NCPCP was delayed for about five decades due to the prolonged conflict in the northern part of Sri Lanka and the delay in the implementation of Murugahakanda and Kaluganga reservoirs. With the dawn of peace in the country in 2009, the foundation was laid for the construction of the Murugahakanda and Kaluganga reservoirs, paving the way for the North Central Province Canal project. Even though the construction of these reservoirs has been completed, it has not yet been possible to provide water to North Central and Northern Provinces due to the delay in construction of the North Central Province Canal from Murugahakanda Reservoir as shown in this map. In this background, the Mahaveli Water Security Investment Program or MWSIP was planned in 2013 and launched in 2016 to divert surplus water in the Mahaveli Basin to North Central, Northern and Northwestern provinces to effectively use for agriculture and drinking. At present, this water is flowing into the mighty ocean without being used for the betterment of the poor farmer community. The Mahaveli Water Security Investment Program is being implemented with the financial assistance from Asian Development Bank and contribution from GoSL, consisting of three major projects. First, the first phase of the North Central Province Canal Project, also known as Upper Alahara Canal Project. Second, Northwestern Province Canal Project or Viamba Alla. And third, Minipay Left Bank Canal Rehabilitation Project. The main project to be implemented under the Mahaveli Water Security Investment Program is the first phase of the North Central Province Canal Project, also known as the Upper Alahara Canal Project or UECP. Under the UEC project, a 9 km long water transfer canal is under construction to divert excess water from the Kaluganga Reservoir to the Murugakanda Reservoir. The water diverted from the Kaluganga Reservoir together with the water available in Murugahakanda Reservoir will be diverted to existing irrigation systems in Polonnaruwa and Anuradhapura districts, including seven major irrigation tanks to meet the irrigation and drinking water requirements in the province. The first phase of the NCPC or UEC is a 65 km long canal consisting of a 28 km long tunnel underground conduits, aqueduct and open trapezoidal canals starting from Murugakanda Reservoir up to a location called Yakalla near Huruluvava. The construction of UEC has already commenced. As shown in the map, Yakalla will be a key water distribution point for North Central Province Canal, which distributes water into three branches. The shorter right bank canal will feed Huruluvava. The second outlet to the northern direction will provide water for phase 2 of NCP canal and the canal to left bank will feed Manangkatya, Eruvava, Nachadua, Nuravava, Thisavava and Mahakanadarava reservoirs in Anuradhapura district. The UEC will provide irrigation water for about 12,500 hectares of paddy lands. In addition to this, about 26,000 acre feet of drinking water will be supplied annually for 25,000 families suffering from CKDU. The third outlet to the northern direction will provide water for phase 2 of NCP Canal. The Northwestern Province Canal Project or Viamba Alla is the second project being implemented under the Mahaveli Water Security Investment Program. NWPCP is to provide Mahaveli water through a proposed new tunnel from Bovathanna Reservoir to Vamadilla Tank and afterward to Upper Mioya and Hakwatunoya basins that are currently suffering from severe water shortages. Under the Viamba Alla project, a 94 km long canal system starting from Vamadilla Reservoir and two new storage reservoirs namely Mahakithula and Mahakirula will be constructed. 
the project will irrigate about 13,000 hectares of paddy lands under eight large tanks and about 350 minor tanks in Pulpitigama, Yapahua and Aduvava areas. The Minipay Left Bank Canal Rehabilitation Project is the third project being implemented under the Mahaveli Water Security Investment Program. This project will heighten the existing Minipay Anicut by 3.5 meters to increase the water holding capacity of the Anicut. In addition, the 74 kilometer long Minipay Left Bank Canal will be completely rehabilitated for the timely provision of assured water to paddy fields in stage 3 and 4 of the canal which are presently suffering from water shortages. Under the second phase of the NCPCP, it is proposed to construct the 85-kilometer-long North Central Province Canal, starting from Yakala Trifurcator to the northern direction along the North Central Province up to Chemmadikulam Tank in Vaunya district. There are 13 branch canals which will be constructed in addition to the main canal and feed nearly 1,200 small tanks located within a 130-tank cascade system covering 43,000 hectares of paddy fields. An ancient cascade system will be maintained in a more efficient manner throughout the year. In addition, another 18,500 hectares will be irrigated under the main tanks and anicut systems in the area. And about 100,000 families in these areas will be greatly benefited from the provision of safe drinking water, a relief for people suffering from kidney diseases. The available water in Kaluganga and Moragahakanda reservoirs are adequate only for the areas benefited under Phase 1 of the NCPCP project and additional water sources are required to provide water to the expected benefited areas beyond Yakalla. Therefore, it has been planned to divert additional water from two water sources in the Mahaveli Basin to Moragahakanda Reservoir. Accordingly, it is planned to divert water from Lower Uma Oya, Randhinigala, Hasalaka Oya and Heen Ganga Reservoir through the proposed Randhinigala Kaluganga Transfer Canal in three stages. In the first stage, a reservoir will be constructed across the Heen Ganga and the excess water will be diverted through a tunnel to the Kaluganga Reservoir. In the second stage, a small reservoir will be constructed across Hasalaka Oya and the excess water will be diverted to Heen Ganga Reservoir through a tunnel. The lower Uma Oya Reservoir will also be constructed and it will be connected to the Randhanigala Reservoir through a tunnel to increase the water availability in Randhanigala Reservoir and also to add 10 megawatts to the national grid by hydropower generation. Finally, Randhanigala Reservoir will be connected to Hasalaka Oya Reservoir by constructing another tunnel. About 70% of the water requirement of the target area of Phase 2 of NCPCP will be provided to Moragahakanda Reservoir by the RKTC system when the entire diversion system is completed. The balance 30% of the water requirement is proposed to be obtained through pumping by constructing a pumping station near the existing Janaranjanavava located in Lower Mahaveli Basin. The pumping station will provide about 220,000 acre-feet or 270 million cubic meters of Mahaveli water from Lower Mahaveli Basin flowing to the sea without being used. Part of this water will feed the Kanthale abandoned sugarcane area and is also planned to meet part of the water requirement of Kanthale and Kaudulla Paddy areas presently supplied from Moragahakanda Reservoir and a similar quantity of water could then be retained in Moragahakanda Reservoir and able to transfer to the North Central Province Canal. This Mahaveli Water Security Investment Program is to be implemented in two phases and the construction of the first phase is already underway, is already underway in these areas under the Upper Alahara Canal Project, Northwestern Province Canal Project and Minipay Left Bank Canal Rehabilitation Project. Studies and surveys required for the second phase of NCPCP are also expected to be completed under MWSIP.
the construction of the second phase will be implemented as a stage-wise development. All the designs, investigations and construction activities are carried out adhering to the internationally accepted environmental and social safeguard standards. The full completion of NCPCP will facilitate the safe drinking and assured irrigation water supply to the community living in North Central and Northern provinces. This will end the long-term water shortage, thus creating economic and social prosperity.